Welcome to my channel. I am Billy James. My channel will consist of sneaker related content. Eventually I'll get into sneaker reviews and unboxing as the channel grows. Most to all sneakers on this channel are available for sale. If you're interested in any sneakers, you can contact me on my, on my social media. My Instagram is BillyJames6 and my Twitter is BillyJames99. I will also be showing the resale value on each sneaker to see if the shoe appreciated or depreciated since sneaker release. If you would like me to get into more sneaker related things such as if you should hold or sell a certain sneaker, comment below. All feedback is appreciated. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we'll be taking a closer look at the Jordan 6 DMP, the 2020 version. Here we have the box, size 10 as usual. And this year's box is different compared to normal Jordan 6 boxes. So you can see it's half gold, half black because of the DMP name, the Defining Moments pack. As we get into it, we see the different tissue paper it has unite all over it not too bad you know especially for the price it's better than the usual tissue paper and there's the shoe all nice and wrapped up let's take her out real quick and there she is with the hand tag and everything oddly enough the hand tag is, is i think it's real metal it has some weight to it Okay, we get into the shoe and we have the front view of it you see it has the two gold jumpman logos the black nubuck which is decent at best it's not really like previous nubucks but it's okay it's all right so you got that gold stripe across the heel tab not too bad it's a good look for the shoe. Got the gold two three on the back. Also iconic. Black jump man. When we come back. And you see that gold pull tag. And it's pretty nice actually, considering the price is it feels real in my opinion. Which oddly enough, Jordan usually doesn't do a good job of. And here we have the bottom, icy blue bottom. Oddly enough, my pair came, I think it was worn, but I got it from Foot Locker because as you can see, it's like marks on the bottom, but I don't really know. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So when it comes to resale value, there's actually no resale value to this shoe. As you can see, a size 10 is 216 on StockX with a return of 189, which is below retail. 